Hey folks, I'm in the BMW M3 CS, and you're gonna hear an instructor's voice talking the whole time. But I am going out on BMW's performance track for a little lead follow situation. I haven't been on track that much, so this is gonna be a fun little thing for me. All right, we should be good now. Okay, here we go. Yeah, here we go. Okay, now we're really moving here. M3 CS, 130 grand, whole lot of horsepower, whole lot of torque, and no on a grip. Holy this thing just sticks like nothing else. Now, it's the first all-wheel drive M3 ever, this generation of car, and it is fast. I'm having no trouble keeping up with the M5 in front. Get a little tail happy, even with all-wheel drive. Oh, and the brakes are just sublime. If you hear that jingling, it's a GoPro battery that died. It's a really technical, tight track. Not getting a ton of speed. Although, I mean, in the M3, you're getting a lot of speed no matter what you do, but it's not a ton. And heavy braking, heavy braking. I'm getting sweaty. I'm a sweaty guy naturally. And when I'm on a racetrack, oh, oh, mama, you don't know. Cut the, cur cut the turn a little bit, into the corner. Heavy on the brakes once again, down a gear. Whee! That's my water bottle, it's fine. Yeah, yeah. We get on this really shifts are violent in this car, even though it's just this EF8 speed transmission. M has tuned it to be absolutely preposterous. It's so fast and so violent. But if you hit the rev limiter, it bogs down like crazy. Which I just... Heavy on the brakes. There we go. He's very nice, the instructor. He's giving me lots of words of encouragement. Little does he know this is my second time on a track ever, and my first time alone. I'm a driving god, what can I say? I do wish it was a lot cooler in here though, I'm a warm, toasty boy right now. There's sh crashing around all over the place, but it's okay. fun little track. It separates the wheat from the chaff, and I am certainly the chaff when it comes to driving, but it's not bad. Track days are a lot more fun when it's not your car. I'll tell you that much. And we're going around one more time. Everything, everything that it was once. Everything that was once in my bag is now out of it. Third. I'm not driving this car on the street, but I'm going to guess it's pretty good.
right around this corner. as you may have imagined. Crazy, I know. You can't see it, but there's a lunatic in a Mini Cooper behind me. Just really having a lot of fun. Here, what we're gonna do here is follow me just over to the left here. We're just gonna sneak through the cones. And just right through here. We're gonna basically just kind of U-turn it. We just wanted to let that Mini go by. We're just letting the Mini go by. And just a big circle here. So folks, I think that's enough for me. I appreciate that. I hope you enjoyed your time watching me struggle going around a track. It's a lot of fun for me. Hopefully it's a lot of fun for you and I'll catch you next time. Bye.